Hello again, everyone. All that most of you spent this interim wondering which campaign I would do next. Whether it be the new Chinese one, or the original Titans expansion one, or even the Golden Gift. Well, you're all wrong. It'll be this obscure little scenario down here, which is only available if you either pre order the original game, or now many years later got the extended edition. Moderately fun little Norse scenario. I'm pretty sure it's not even intended to be canon, though. Years ago, the god Hades opened four passages from the underworld in the darkest forest of the Norselands. Based on strange attacks from the undead, the location of these passages must be dangerously close to a small village where I grew up. Solid voice acting, as usual. I am Regenleaf. I have returned to my home and must lead my village in a battle to find and close these passages from Erebus. Well, let's get to it. First of all, no farming. Why would you even attempt that, you idiots? There's huntables right there. You get lumber. And dwarves get gold for me. It's not going to be too short on that, actually. Regenleaf here is a one-woman army, as usual. I have a pretty solid group of starting forces at first glance, but remember, most of them cannot actually fight just yet because we're still in the archaic age. Send these out on wall building duty. Spread them out, may as well. Gather some lumber to build myself a dock. And the raiding cavalry should go out and I think there's some cows around here somewhere. Little narrow passages. They can attack from many directions, so don't let them. Cows. Alright. We haven't seen cows all that often. They're basically the same as all other vertebrates in the game, just with a slightly higher food cap. They're no useful. Get these guys back here, we can expect some trouble later on. And you get to work on that dock that I mentioned needing, and why don't you go and help them? And you too. Everybody help with the dock. Actually, just this one guy should be sufficient over here to build one last wall, blocking off access that way. Something, something. Regan, you can stand here and be ready to intercept the first wave, which will be coming quite soon, usually. Don't worry about the scout wolves, by the way. They never actually even try to attack you. Yeah. Alright, that is probably enough people on lumber. So as these guys yeah. finish, I'm going to retask yeah. them. Yeah. Yeah. Onto food. And you can start training those fishing ships, and you guys can start training the houses that I'm going to need. Ah, Regan is being attacked, so let's get some backup over there. So you can two or three hit kill these guys pretty easily. Yeah. That's probably enough of that for now. Yep, she'll take him out. Alright. You... Oh, two more fishing ships are needed. You guys build me a house. I need to get my temple down soon, though. So that I can age up and get everybody stronger. That should be all the early, early raids that I face. So let me go out and do some more scouting and find the other underworld passages. Something. 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 There are quite a few. Four in total. Let's build another layer of wall. Let's let them send like a few weak shades there, so if I build an extra wall, there's a fight through two of them, and they'll basically never break it. You guys keep working on that, though. No, you guys are not being intelligent. Fine. Artificial stupidity. Let's look at that one first. A few villagers can crowd around him. Right, I think there's some... There we go. There's the cows I've been looking for. And here's the underworld passage up there somewhere. Nope, no, Dragon they Don't run ahead of everybody. Alright, so soon we'll be able to age up. Let me cancel training more villagers. Don't need any more. They'll just slow down my growth rate. I do still need a few more houses and barracks and things like that. So I'm going to keep people gathering lumber for a little bit. There we go. So that's one Underworld Passage. There's those Something. cows again. Those wacky cows that were re-recruited by the Underworld Passage. Task them over to there. Great. What are you idle from? Some Whatever. Alright, I can age up. And I can start training Hearse here. Need to do that as much as possible. What are you even doing? Sat. Having the ox right in the middle is not efficient, but that's where the animals split up. Alright, well, let's get everybody starting to group together. I think I'm going to build another temple. Not that it's efficient, I should build a longhouse instead. But I kind of just want to have two temples because I can build them now, whereas the longhouse I'll have to wait for. Great. All of you guys, as soon as you finish that one. Nope, 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 nope. Ah, these villagers are being a nuisance. We'll get them all gathering up together in the north, where the one ox cart will be shared between the lumber and the food people. Should work out. Alright, let's get over there. 
Actually, I'm going to retask one of these guys just to train to this town location so that if troops do come this way, I'm ready to deal with them. And now that my other troops can fight, I may as well add them to that group. Let's get up there. Get to work. Something. There we go. You guys have finished that, so go gather food over here. Let's have one of them. Maybe two, actually. We are kind of short on gold. Go gather gold. It's unusual for me to need that much, but we may as well work on it. Alright, now these things start belching out large numbers of troops as soon as they get to half health. So they need to watch for that and be ready. Up until then, I can do whatever I like without concern. Train from there. You guys, why don't you build me a house? Another house. Here it goes. Any second now. There we go. Fire Giant's the big threat there, obviously. Even regularly doesn't so great against them because they have high pierce armor. We haven't seen Shades too often. They're very weak units, not a threat. That should be the only forces to send out to really defend that one. Things are going pretty solidly, I would say. Ah, there's the expected attack of Shades, so I built two walls there. Double layer, very cheap, and will keep the enemy out very effectively. So effective, not going to send these troops back to deal with them. Just going to have regularly peel these guys up, then we'll go for the next passage. As soon as that finishes. Great. Well, you know, while I'm short on gold, let me maybe train some Valkyries out of here. Yo. Right. Yo. Let's open that thing up into a gate. That'll do. Come on, heal him up. He's fantastic at that, as you know. In previous missions. Yo. All right. Gate these things, and once they break down that wall, then we'll be ready for them. All right, let's get to work on the next one. There's, as I said, repeatedly four in total. Now retask up there. Hmm, getting close to my population cap, so just train the houses preemptively. Those shades are nearly done. Don't take too much longer. You guys, and you guys who found lumber, why don't you all now gather from these cattle that I've painstakingly collected? How long did we finish that? Not a working over here. I could have been a little bit more efficient about some of this stuff. Alright, so again, same thing will happen. Once this thing gets down to half, that's when it'll pour out enemy troops to deal with me. To attempt to deal with me anyway. Alright. Massacre those shades. Now shades, I should mention, are not myth units. So heroes are not effective against them, but they're not good against anything else. Uh, ah, ancestors. Usually a strong power, but when you have this many hearses around, they're not going to be able to do much of a thing. I'll kill them as fast as they spawn. What are you doing over there? Oh, Alright, great. Let's get these guys over here where we can start working multiple underworld passages at the same time, hopefully. And in the meantime, keep training people to maybe there. This thing is almost done. And these guys have almost found the next passage. Let me torch that place. We'll have a hard fight here with you know what will come out of there soon enough. But it's just them not back up everybody else, but it should work out okay. And there's the next passage. So I'll tell these guys to fight there next. And soon the enemy will come out. Be ready to deal with them. There we go. Oh, another ancestor. They're gonna have a hard, hard time of that. Let's test some more hearses over there because they're gonna need reinforcements. You guys, tear that thing down. Let's get Brimley over there, which can actually help them. All right, they dealt with the fire giant. All right, so once they take care of these ancestors, they should finish that thing off. And I'll work through this next one in pretty good time, I think. All right, tear that thing down, and we're almost there. It'll be a pretty nice wind time. About nine minutes, kind of the opening cinematic. Not bad at all. So, I hope you all enjoyed this scenario and are looking forward to the next campaign. I'll keep you in suspense a little bit longer about what it'll be, of course. This mission reminds me that some of you fine folks mentioned making scenarios yourselves in the past and were interested in seeing me try them. I don't make any guarantees, but I might consider it if you send them my way. I think I won't even bother fighting these new missions, I'll just finish off the passage. With as many guys as can crowd around them, it'll be faster that way. So, fairly straightforward mission, at least if you take my aggressive approach. Come to think of it, I think the title, Closer to Home, is probably a reference to the chapter introducing the Norse a long way from home. Pretty clever. Well, I'm glad to be back. Have a great day, everyone.